Where's my rent money, Josh? It was due this morning. Oh, uh, hello, Mr. Andrews. Uh, oh, uh, here, here it is. Where's the rest? You're $150 short. I know. I'm sorry, but business has been really slow lately. I just need a few more days to get the money together. I just... I don't want to hear any excuses. I'm giving you 24 hours or I'm filing for eviction. You understand? Oh, please, sir. I've been here for 20 years. I can't lose my home. I have nowhere to go. Times are hard for everyone right now. And we all have to help each other get through them. That's not my problem. 24 hours, Josh, or well, you're out. This den looks amazing, sis. You always outdo yourself. <laughs> hey, Uncle Rick. Hey. Whoa, look at all this food. But I, I thought we couldn't afford to eat like this, Mom. <laughs> Just have a seat, sweetie. Wait, what does she mean? Are you having problems with money? Oh. Martha. Is everything okay? I didn't want to have to tell you this, but I lost my job a few months ago. And I've been having a really hard time finding work. Why didn't you tell me? You're my little sister. I would have helped. I was embarrassed. I almost had to cancel this dinner tonight because I didn't even have enough money to buy groceries. Hey, there's no need to be embarrassed, okay? Wait, how did you get the groceries then? Well, there was a kind stranger who helped me. You see, ever since I got laid off, Things have been really hard. Some days, I don't even know if I'll be able to put food on the table for Mickey and I. This morning, when I went to buy groceries for tonight's dinner, I stood there in embarrassment as I realized I didn't have enough money. I put the groceries back and I left. Just when the kind store owner decided to help me and give me the groceries for free. So you see, if it wasn't for that kind man, this dinner wouldn't have been possible. Wow, that's incredible. What a great guy. I wish I could meet him, you know, and shake his hand. Well, you can, because I invited him to dinner tonight as a way to say thank you. That must be him. Uh -huh. Hi. Hi. Come on in. This is the gentleman I was telling you about. Thank you so much for helping my little sis. Josh, what are you doing here? Uh, uh, Mr. Andrews, I... Uh... You two know each other? Yeah, he's, um... He's one of my tenants. You're the one who gave her the groceries? Yeah. But, but why? When you're struggling yourself, well, I may not have much, but I know what it feels like to struggle. So, uh, I just wanted to help. Thank you so much for helping my little sister. I, I feel terrible for how I treated you earlier. 
Ah, that's okay. I, I, I understand. Look, uh, don't worry about this month's rent, okay? It, it's on me. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> really? Yeah. Because now I realize that times are hard for everyone, and if we're going to get through this, we all need to help each other. Thank you so much. Now let's eat while the food's still hot. <laughs> Sounds great. <laughs> right this way. Uh. Hey, Darman fam. So you see, we're not just telling stories, we're changing lives. And when you share my videos, you're helping to change lives too. You really can manifest the life that you desire. And even if you're struggling right now, your struggle is your story and your story is your superpower. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.